Well, I think so many high achievers in our industry and outside of it, it's this thin line of what makes them great and what makes them want to achieve more and help more people and, and grow their businesses and all of that. That is a form of this addictive personality. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, I feel that too. And it's like, you, you get that, that mindset and that commitment and this is who I am and this is what I do, that identity, you get that pointed in the wrong direction. And, you know, a lot of us can find ourselves going down this path, where, but, to, you know, we're all in. Yeah. And like, that's what you get. You yes. know? Uh, so I think that, that self-awareness is, is so powerful. Yeah. And earlier you said that whole zero to hundred thing. So mm-hmm. like, what are we saying as our identity? Mm-hmm. And so that's one earlier this week that I was talking to somebody and I don't know what my 2024 goals are going to be yet, but it might be something like find 50. Mm-hmm. Like stop saying you're a zero to a hundred or you're going to continue manifesting that you're zero to a hundred. Yeah. My family neither wants me at zero or a hundred. That, that's not how they operate, you know? So, and what I mean by zero to a hundred is I'm either all in or so like Saturday routine, for example, I wake up, uh, talk to my wife, uh, 10K ice bath, and then it's family time. But if I- You run a 10K every Saturday? Every Saturday. Because I, I don't want to lose that endurance from marathon running because that endurance free falls. So I just want to always have it, I guess. So it's, uh, yeah. <laughs> Lunatic. God bless you. Yeah, Carry yeah. on. <laughs> so when- if I go on the couch, I turn to zero. Like if mm. I, you need a, like a forklift to get me off the couch because I yeah. don't want to move anymore. And then mm. my daughter's asked me to go play. Let's go outside. And I'm no, thanks. No, thanks. Well, that's not fair to her. And I, and my identity is I'm a zero to 100 guy. Mm. Well, what does 50 look like? Yeah. And so how am I going to set a consistency goal that says after 10 minutes on the couch, you're going to get up and do something because I need to break that. I need to break that zero to 100 for my family's sake. 